blackmailed. Why? What happened? Well, I, uh, I've been married 11 years. I have two little boys. They're lovely. And um, my wife and I... Well, that happens a lot. Yeah, well, it happened to me. So I went on Craigslist. I guess I figured it would be all right if I had an affair with a married woman, if you know what I'm saying. Did you really meet her? Sorry. Let's say that you have a, a friend in Japan named Hirohito. And Hirohito lives in a tiny remote fishing village in Japan. And he wants to send you a postcard. But Hirohito only knows Japanese, and, well, you don't read Japanese. So he sends his postcard to the Japanese post office, which translates the postcard into a universal post office language. A code. A code, exactly. And is the post office in Japan? Anywhere and everywhere. It's sort of like like God, you know, except without the, um, the big beard and the flowing white robes. Channing McLaren blew the lid off information the SCC already had but didn't act on. That is completely unfair. Nevertheless, perception is everything. What's that? It's just a little press release I've prepared. There's a reporter at the Times waiting on my call to print it. Fuck you. Thank you, Larry. Oh, there's no need to thank me, Rita. This is my job, the law. Come on, kick it, Evan, send it! Okay, so um, you, you hear them come in, you start panicking, you're worried, you didn't... Well, I know, I'm not trying to understand motive here, I'm just trying to analyze the facts. There, there were drugs involved. Yes, I, I, I read that. Send it! Send it! You know, I, I think really, honestly, the, the best bet here is the insanity defense. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Seriously, he's insanity defense? Hey, 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 listen to the man. He knows what he's talking no, about. No, listen, I, I went into the wrong apartment. I mean, the guy was a madman. Trying to protect his kids. I wasn't going to do anything. I was just trying to... Men explain. use their Just hands. let me fucking finish! Yeah, well, yeah, I think it's just this ponder insanity for the time being, shall we? Okay, bring it on in. Let's take a blow, everybody. Nice practice. So, I understand that you folks want to learn more about adoption. Yes, we just wanted to get an idea of what was involved. Well, you have come to the right place. As long as you're in good health. I do technically have melanoma, but my doctor says I'm doing great. My tumors are virtually undetectable. I'm going to just uh, stop you right there. Um, you know, it's difficult enough to convince expectant mother to hand over her newborn to a couple of your advanced age. Wow, you guys look like you're having a lot of fun. Gus! Gus, actually, it's part of a demonstration for the product. You're welcome to stay. Uh, no, I, I, I got that, uh, that conference call. Yeah, so... <laughs> uh, uh, Ryerson, what'd you find? Well, <clears throat> I uh, just completed my autopsy on Mr. Wyatt here. I was told that, that your theory was that the, <clears throat> the, the heart was harvested. It is. <clears throat> yeah, well, buy a hat and hang on to it, because um, that theory might have a little wrinkle. <laughs>